Secret of the Dragon's Egg. After searching for many, many years, the mighty Fisto and his Mount Stridor returned to the Palace of Eternia with an amazing treasure in hand. Prince Adam, Tila, and Man-at-Arms welcomed them. This is my greatest treasure, Fisto explained. The Dragon Box. Did you say the, the dragon? Prince Adam said nervously. I think there's some sweeping I must attend to. But I have no key to the box I found, Fisto said. So I must use my strength to open it and learn the secret location of the last dragon's egg. In the next room, Prince Adam worried about the secrets within the strangely decorated box. Fisto has long searched for a dragon's egg, thought Prince Adam. Now he might need help dealing with what he's discovered. By the power of Greystone! With the secret of the power sword, Prince Adam became He-Man. Did I hear someone mention dragons? He-Man asked as he entered the castle room. You may need my sword and strength to battle dragons. Hopefully we will not battle them, explained Fisto. This ancient map should guide us to the last dragon's egg. However, unknown to all, their words were being overheard. Far away, deep within sinister Snake Mountain, Skeletor and his evil followers gathered around a swirling mystical pool. Now watch, you fools, cried Skeletor. You will see and hear exactly what my spy bat is seeing and hearing. Suddenly, the image in the pool grew clear. The evil warriors were able to view the events in the Palace of Eternia. If we find the dragon's egg, He-Man said, we can raise the baby dragon to be a powerful friend and a mighty flying mount. This parchment holds the secret location of the egg. It shows three hiding places, but only one is the true one, He-Man observed. We'll split up and each explore a different place. Learning from the spy bat that the first location on the ancient map was a dark and eerie cave, Skeletor dispatched one of his evil servants. Go, Whiplash! Head off mad at arms in the Forbidden Caverns! The powerful but evil Whiplash arrived at the cavern some time before man at arms. He waited in the dark shadows to strike. Faster than lightning, the monster tail swung over the surprised warrior. Whiplash, you fiend! Now you'll be trapped under tons of rock! Hissed the lizard-like Whiplash as rocks caved in on top of Man-at-Arms. But Man-at-Arms moved even faster than Whiplash. With a mighty and well-placed blow, one of the falling rock hit another until the final one struck down the fleeing Whiplash. Yeah! Man-at-Arms quickly searched the cave. The cave was empty, thought Man-at-Arms, except for Whiplash. But I must get back to the palace and warn the others that Skeletor and his monsters are searching for the dragon egg as well. Meanwhile, at the base of Fire Mountain, Fisto and Stridor were seeking the egg at the map's second location, and Skeletor's servant Beastman had already arrived. Stridor is mine to control. My power to control all beasts and animals will cause your own horse to turn against you, Fisto, boasted Beastman. Stridor reared up and threw Fisto to the hard ground. Beastman's wicked laugh echoed off the mountain. I have defeated you, he cried. As Beastman prepared the search for the dragon's egg, he ordered Goatman to destroy Fisto. Suddenly, Stridor sprang to life. Fisto's mighty fist lashed out. We've caught you off guard, Beastman and Goatman, cried Fisto. Stridor is half machine and not affected by the power of Beastman. He only faked turning against me so he can fool you. Later, at the palace, He-Man and Tila learned that the first two locations on the dragon's egg map were false. Then Murky Lake, the last location, must be the true one. Let's go. He and Tila entered their dragon walker. Deep in Snake Mountain, Skeletor were raged. All my servants have failed! But they have shown me that Murky Lake is the place where the secret of the dragon's egg lies. I'll pilot the Rotan and meet my men at Murky Lake. Look! 
said He-Man, as he and Tila reached Murky Lake. Merman has found the crystal ball in the lake! Now it will tell Skeletor and his evil warriors the location of the dragon's egg! But to stop him, Tila screamed, we first have to stop the lake monster he sent after us! The mighty power sword of He-Man and power staff of Tila quickly dispatched the monster, but too late! Merman and Skeletor had escaped! Back at Snake Mountain, Skeletor's rage was almost uncontrollable. I see nothing in this crystal! It's worthless! Merman depart! Knowing that Skeletor's minions were scattered throughout the land, He-Man and Teela boldly charged Snake Mountain. He-Man and Teela, here! You want the crystal? Very well! The worthless thing is yours! Striking the stone floor with a thundering crash, the crystal cracked just like an egg. Just like an egg? So that's the secret of the crystal, He-Man cried. It didn't show Skeletor the location of the dragon's egg because the crystal is the dragon's egg. The dragon is mine, Skeletor screamed, grabbing the newly hatched dragon baby. I will train it for battle. What are you looking at? Suddenly, searing heat surrounded Skeletor. Only the black magic of the Havoc Staff saved him from being burned. It's the Mother Dragon, cried Tila. She's come to claim her baby. Stop, you evil monster, He-Man cried. We've all lost. All babies, even dragon babies, belong to their mothers. You're a fool, Skeletor screamed as He-Man held him at bay. We could train the dragon to do our bidding. Their leathery wings flapping with great fury Mother Dragon and her baby disappeared into the sky. So, He-Man said, Now that we are face to face, it is time for our final battle. But just then, the floor of the chamber magically opened at Skeletor's command. Find me if you can, He-Man! <laughs> he can't trick us, He-Man said. He hoped to have us search through the secret passageways of Snake Mountain until his evil warriors returned to outnumber us. Instead, we used the opportunity to escape this foul place. We'll meet him another day, said Tila. Back at the Palace of Eternia sometime later, Fisto kept the broken dragon box. It's not much of a treasure now, he said, but it is a thrilling memento of a most dangerous adventure. Too bad Prince Adam was too busy sweeping to share the danger, Tila mocked. Danger? <laughs> it sounds as if you were babysitting. <laughs>